Welcome back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack Kraken Addiction. We've got a nice little box here going. Let's get it opened on up. Uh, good old Modern Horizons. We've opened uh, quite a few of these lately. and uh, Man, do I love opening these boxes. These are, again, one of my favorite ones to open on up. So let's get this one busted on open and have a little look-see here. Whew. All right, well, let's get right into it here. And what do we got here in front? We've got an Ayula and a Sarah. All right, not bad. Well, this box is for our patron, Steve. Steve, I hope we can get you some great stuff here. There's a lot of good, goody, goody, goodies and fun that are inside of here. So we'll do our best. Best of luck, and thank you very, very much. All right, well, here we go. Through the forest. And Kaya's Guile. Very useful card. Um, I'm trying to think if there's... Is there anything in the common slot? I think there might be like just like Ephemerate. It's just kind of a useful card, but nothing of significant value. There's a, a couple of things in the uncommon slot that, are, that have some monetary value, but that's about it. All right, Snow-Covered Island. Into the Bazaar, Trade Mage. Your dream... Arkham's Astrolab isn't bad. There's a handful of kind of decent things in here, but yeah, this is a, a sweet set. Like I said, it's, as I, I've mentioned this before, but I'll say it again, it kind of has a, a master's feel, um, but you get the 36 packs, which is always cool. Snow covered into, whoa, 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 whoa. Winter's Rest. I've not opened a lot of that. It's kind of cool looking. And the Cloud Shredder Sliver. The Shredder. The Ninja Turtle Shredder. Squirrel's Nest, uh, do a little peek here, nothing else there. But yeah, how's your day going? I hope it's going well. Um, I am at the tail end of the night here. And this uh, video will, will take us into the next day. All right, we got the Hall of Hilliod's Generosity. Excellent card, probably around five bucks. You can see in the bottom left here, should be a tally going. Talisman, we'll throw in the talismans, those are always nice. Talisman, why not? Lesser Masticor. Lots of cool stuff in here. Just useful, good cards all around out of this set. Just fantastic. Alright, let's get the big Wren. Wren and six. That's what we want. Ooh, Tranquil Thicket. Into Mirrored and Besieged. Rebuild and a Tribute Mage. Astrolab. Anything else in there? You got a goat nap. There's always a good old goat nap inside of these. Beware of the goat nap. Of course, we're also keeping our eye out for the Nether Spirit and the Cordial Vamper. Those are some some running jokes of our group. All right, there we go. I have not seen you in a while. The seasoned pyromancer. Fantastic. Great hit. And there's a, one of the good uncommons, Soul Herder. Do a little peeky there. All right. Well, we got our first mythic, and that's a good one. Season Pyromancer. All right. Into the forest and tectonic reformation. Mantling blow, a sliver, and some other goodies. But yeah, Steve. Thanks so much for uh, <clears throat> hooking us up here. Really fantastic. Um, if you'd like to be like Steve or any of our other patrons, check out the links in the description. You can always become a patron and get some booster boxes open for you here on the channel. All right. Oh, weird. Another Kaius Guile. Ooh, weird duplication box we have working here. I don't know if I trust that. I don't know if I trust that for one second. It's like a dirty chiller pillar. All right. Well, if we're going to get duplication, let's get duplicate mythics, duplicate uh, force of negations. That is what we're shooting for if we're going to go duplication. All right, all right. Fake out there. Into Reap the Past. Again, if you are playing that color combination, highly recommend playing Reap the Past. It is, uh, in my opinion, a very excellent card. Not of particularly high value, but a very good card. Getting stuff back from the old graveyard. 
and the Goblin Engineer. Fact or Fiction, that's a good one. We got the doggo over there having a little nightmare. Uh-oh. Can you hear her? Let's wake her up. Sophie! I don't know if that'll wake her up. Maybe she can wake up this box and give us a nice little Ren and Six. We'll find out. All right, forest into, whoa, it got us a mythic, the Hex Drinker. Sweet. All right, let's go on a nice little mythic run here. Oh, Ephemerate, that's a cool card. All right, now, let's do it. Mythic run, mythic run. Oh man, this one does not want to open. Crumble pack, crumble packs are always good luck. Crumble packs contain all the mythics because they don't want you to open them. Oh, it's a little peaky. It's a rare. Ooh, it's a collector roof. That's a good one. Exclude. And a goblin. All right, we got an Ayula Queen in this pack. So let's see if she can bring us any luck. Oh, it's a terrible throw of that pack. Get it out of there. All right. Snow covered planes into Sisse Weatherlight Captain. Nothing really in the uncommon slot. Nothing really in the common slot. All right, let's sneak one more mythic before we move on over to the right side. That would be just perfect. Snow covered mountain into the nurturing peatland, aka the pog beatland. All right, that's our first of the land series. Definitely something you want to see. Man, oh man, do I want to hit another Ren and Six. That would be just fantastic. Snow Covered Island. Into the Fallen Shinobi. Watch for tomorrow. Another Talisman. Mother Bear. Mother Bear always protects her cubs. All right, let's do it. Snow Covered Forest into, ooh, Elad Amri's Call, the Foil Rare. Sweet. And an Archmage's Charm. Really nice pack there. A Talisman and a Wing Shards. Uh, yeah, very nice. A very goblin and sliver heavy out of this set. So two of my favorite things as far as tribal goes. Mountain into whoa, mm -hmm. there it is! Spicy <laughs> <a> meatball. <laughs> you have just heard a pre-recorded message of Brett saying that's a spicy a meatball. Oh baby, and a generous gift as well. Oh, man. Man, I had been in a bad run of hitting uh, Ren and Six, but not in this particular case. I'm, uh, I think I'm two for four now. That's a, that's a pretty good run, right? I'll take that. Got to get back on my Force of Negation track now. Force of Rage. Tried to summon it out of there. Three and feeder. Oop. Now we're throwing things. Ooh, I do like hitting that. Chiller Pillar for good luck. Ren and six, baby. That's what you need to hit. All right, now let's not, we won't even get greedy. We just want rares now. Let's just get a, you know, just a Prismatic Vista, Force Negation. We're not asking for much. Sarah the Benevolent. Man, you are up to four Mythics all of a sudden. Just like that. Anything in there? Trustworthy Scout. Mr. Steve. Woohoo! Coming through in the clutch. He's been a longtime patron of ours, so he deserves a little good luck here. Force of Virtue. All right, we're hitting the forces. We just need to get the right ones. We want green and blue as far as your forces go. That's what we're looking for here. Green and blue. Go quick. Nope. It's a decoy. Try to sneak it in there. I think it make it, maybe it could get there. Pashalik Mons. Another one of the goblins out of this set. Is that right? 
Spell Snuff. Man, oh man, though, you got the big daddy of them all, the Ren and Six. Let's see if we can get the real big daddy, Big Daddy Urza. Ooh, Fiery Islet. Very nice. Another one of the land series. You're up to two of those. Scale Up and a Talisman. Both great cards. All right. Uh, let's, uh, let's compliment those lands. Let's get a Prismatic Vista. Take a sword, too. That'd be nice. Forest? Into a Mama mia, <laughs> right on spicy cue. A meatball. The Prismatic Vista. Another spicy meatball. Holy hell in a handbasket. This is a nice box. Here comes Astrolab. Spore Frog. Man, what a box. And there's still quite a bit left here. So if you are still sticking around at this point in the video, which I don't know why you wouldn't be, make sure you give a thumbs up, hit the notification bell. We're doing videos every day. Usually, oh, I don't know, somewhere between 6 and 8 a.m. Central Time. So, oh, there he is. <laughs> the Cordial Vamper. Get him out of here. That stinking vampire. And the Chiller Pillar, for good luck. Oh man, though, what a crazy box. You get a Foil Mythic? That would be sweet. Swamper? Into the Unsettled Mariner. Shenanigans? Type of shenanigans, right? Good old shenanigans. Man, this has really been a nice box. Let's get, uh, so we got the Prismatic Vista like we wanted. Now we get, need to get the Force of Negation. Let's get it right here. Oh, really nice card though. Winds of Abandon is very solid. It's definitely a, I don't even know if it's underrated at this point, but I feel like no one cared about that card for whatever reason. I know it's at sorcery speed, but that's, Again, Exiling in Commander is a fantastic ability. Trustworthy Scout into the Deep Forest Hermit. The Hermit Crab. Unearth, that's kind of a cool card. Just a one mana return type card. So we're probably down to seven, eight cards at this point. Iula's Influence. Bolt. Nimble Mongoose. Remember that card? Old school sweet card with Shroud. I feel like Shroud was always the intention of uh, of Magic. I'd be curious to hear the history on um, how Hexproof, I know it was originally can't be the target of spells or abilities your opponents control, but I'm wondering how they decided that Hexproof was a, a good idea as a Boggles player who loves Hexproof, but even still. A putrid goblin. Out of focus. There we go. And, of course, Ayula Queen Among Bears. Because what is a box without an Ayula Queen Among Bears? It's just a slightly better box is really what it is. Anyways, yeah, if anyone knows the, the history of that, the kind of Magic's history of that, I would be... Curious to hear about that in the comments. Snow-covered plains. Oh, and there's another mythic. Look at that. Sword of Sinew and Steel. Fantastic. Wowza wowza. Very nicely done. So, most likely we're not hitting um, Big Daddy Urza, but hey, you never know. Mountain? Dead of Winter. Any other goodies in here? Let's do a little peek. Not really. All right, looks like about five packs left here. So, Steve, I think uh, hopefully you're pretty happy with this box so far. I think it's been a really good one. I'll let Omri's call once again. This time in regular non-foil format. Remember it? Man, oh man, do I love some Modern Horizons, though. This is such a sweet set. I think got a lot of hate when it came out. I It got pumped up, and then it like just reverted out of nowhere. Genesis. I think it's an excellent set. Tribute Mage. Uh, just three left for Mr. Steve. 
good luck in the close. Again, if you're still sticking around, make sure you give a thumbs up on your way out. And the Collected Conjuring. Definitely not uh, one of the ones that you're probably looking for. But that's okay. We got plenty of good stuff in here. Uh, we still need that Force of Negation, don't we, on the way out? Come on now. Show me that Force of Negation. Blue for good luck. All right, a Sunbaked Canyon. I will definitely take that. Up to four lands. Uh, let's see, anything good in here? Chiller Pillar. All right, you're down to boop, your last pack. So thank you once again to Steve and to all of our patrons and all of you who are supporting and subscribing to the channel. All right, Prohibit. Into the Cabal Booster Therapist. On the way, and ooh, and a Soul Herder. On the way out the door. So really fantastic box. You should see your total popping up there. Uh, we've got one last thing before we go. We've got uh, just a handful of these guys left. Let's uh, let's get them sorted here. It right, should be good here. All right, I'm just going to close the eyes and go one, two, three. Let's try there. All right, Thassa's Oracle as your bonus rare or mythic. And you are getting that, um, anyone that opens up a booster box this month, as one of our patrons, you get a bonus rare or mythic. So there you have it. Hopefully you enjoyed your box. Hopefully everyone enjoyed watching. That's all we have for now here today. And uh, much more to come tomorrow. So until next time, this has been Booster Therapy. Thank you.